Leaders at NASA just wrapped up a press conference with Russia's space agency saying Russia will launch another spacecraft to bring home one astronaut and two cosmos, cosmonauts. So far, a launch date has not been set, but it comes after their original Soyuz capsule was struck by a micrometeoroid and started leaking coolant last month. News 6's Ezzy Castro was listening in on the update and has the latest. International Space Station Program Manager Joel Montalbano and cosmonaut Sergei Kriglev with Roscosmos giving an update on the Soyuz capsule damaged last month. Video shows coolant spewing out of the Soyuz, just as two cosmonauts were preparing for a spacewalk. Uh, NASA will take the next couple of weeks. We'll be working with the uh, commercial crew program and our U.S. domestic partners on laying out the flight plan for the next few months. So just uh, we'll need a couple more weeks before we're ready to uh, define a bunch of new launch dates. Officials explained the leak on the capsule was caused by a micrometeoroid, which was set to bring back both cosmonauts and a NASA astronaut back to Earth. We need to dock a new replacement Soyuz before we undock old one because we need to move some stuff from old Soyuz to new one. Uh, personal belonging, as we said, uh, seat liners, uh, space suits, and uh, survival gear. Kirkliff says the plan is to send a Soyuz replacement to the ISS first before safely bringing the crew back, which could take longer than planned. We don't have final date yet. Uh, I think it is going to be mid of March or maybe uh, end of March. Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.